Whale money has exploded in recent weeks and is continuing to pump as we speak. As long as whale money is moving into the market, this should push the price of Solana up too. But as soon as whale money begins dropping out of the market, once whales decide they have overbought and begin moving money out, this is where we should see a drop in price as well. How's it going, everyone? Today is November 1st, and from the absolute bottom of October to the where we're sitting today, we saw a 113% move to the upside. Congratulations to anyone that bought in at this level, you just saw a massive profit. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly where I think Solana is heading next, why, and what you can do to make the best possible trades. Let's jump into it. Thanks so much for joining us for today's Solana video. My name is Jake with TradeConfident.io, here to bring you your daily crypto insight. We really appreciate you joining us, and if you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe for more crypto content, education, and analysis. If you are new to this channel, welcome. We're really excited to trade with you, and I wanna let you know, if you scroll down into the description of the video you're watching right now, you can access our membership at the first link. We're 79 wins, zero losses on our trade calls. We provide daily crypto metrics, and we have a $1 million profit account challenge shown with members only content. You don't want to miss those videos. You can get access to our indicators for 60% off at the second link, and you can join our Telegram for free at the third link. Before we get into the metrics, I want to show you how absurdly fast Solana is gaining momentum. This teal line right here, this one is Solana. And you can see compared to the other cryptocurrencies, gray right here is Ethereum. Orange right here is Bitcoin. You can see an influx of 73.44% into Solana compared to 30% on Ethereum and 23% on Bitcoin. And the rest of the altcoins are actually in the negative. This just goes to show how absolutely absurd the inflow of cash into Solana has been. Now Solana is actually Trade Confidence number two holding. We own about $38,400 worth and we are up 12% on those trades. Bitcoin is the only one that's higher with nearly $70,000 in. We are very lucky to be in Solana right now. And based on what we're seeing, this could actually continue further. Here's a blog post from Binance itself showing here are three reasons why Solana is pumping. Solana has been on an impressive run over the past few weeks with the price of Solana surging over 38% in the last seven days alone. What is causing this pump? Reason number one, Solana was oversold during the FTX collapse. I think this is absolutely true. Solana was heavily oversold during the FTX implosion. When FTX went bankrupt, the price of Sol crashed a whopping 79% in a matter of weeks. After the decline in the FTX collapse, all investors had one question in mind, will Solana recover? This brutal sell-off was driven by forced liquidations of FTX and Alameda's Solana holdings. But here's the thing. Solana didn't have any direct involvement in FTX's shady dealings, at least as far as what's publicly known. It could be argued that the sell-off was irrational and pushed Sol far below its true value. With that in mind, Solana is bouncing back more aggressively than other top cryptos, and it's making up for lost ground in correcting the oversold conditions. Number two, and I think this is actually the main reason, a wave of positive developments in the Solana ecosystem. In late August, Solana launched an integration with Shopify that allows merchants to accept crypto payments settled in USDC on the Solana blockchain. Over 1 million Shopify stores now have access to fast, low-cost Solana payments. Shortly after, Visa announced it was using USDC on Solana for its new cross-border settlement network. This could dramatically improve the efficiency of Visa's global payment operations. On top of that, and we're not going to go through this one because it's not Solana specific. There's just in general surging decentralized finance activity. All of these are major reasons starting around this area why Solana has pumped so significantly, especially after the FTX collapse right here where we bottomed out before finally recovering. Now we'll get into the live charts in just a bit. First, I wanna cover the metrics. We're gonna scroll all the way down to Solana and the very first metric you're gonna to wanna to pay attention to is the Solana Emotional Index. We are currently in greedy territory. Typically when you reach that, this will be a bearish reading. You can see right here, move down, right here, we got a little bit of a move down. Back here, move down, back here, move down. Tons and tons of greedy readings and very consistently we're seeing moves down from there. But personally, I think we're actually going to see a price rise a little bit further before we actually top out on this metric. Next up, I want to take you to the Solana volatility breakout detector. We are still seeing insane amounts of volatility in Solana. Once we reach the top, we may actually trade sideways for a little bit. This is called distribution and is very normal after huge moves like we've seen. If we get that distribution, that's the point that we'll probably see a drop below the breakout zone, in which case we'll see another large move. 
Only time can tell which direction that will be, but as it plays out, you're going to want to track Solana Whale Smart Money. Where well money goes, the price is likely to go too, and we just saw a massive surge in the likelihood of short sentiment. This has surpassed the negative 800 level that we're typically looking for short trades to happen, and because of that, we should be expecting short trades soon. But this metric only tracks what is likely to come. Let's see what's happening right this second with the whale money flow relative to price chart. Whale money has exploded in recent weeks and is continuing to pump as we speak. As long as whale money is moving into the market, this should push the price of Solana up too. But as soon as whale money begins dropping out of the market, once whales decide they have overbought and begin moving money out, this is where we should see a drop in price as well. So keep a very close eye on this metric specifically. And from here, we're going to move into the major support and resistance levels to find our next targets. We have structure support at $32.40, and I'll have to show you structure resistance on the live chart, so stay tuned for that. But a major drop from this point would very easily reach the $32.40 range. Last but not least is the Solana trade signals chart. You're gonna to wanna to pay very close attention to these sell signals. Right here, you can see sell signal move down, sell signal move down, sell signal move down. We did get one that resulted in a short squeeze. This is very normal. We actually saw a short squeeze over here too, but didn't get that sell signal. However, based on the fact that other indicators are lining up more bearish, if we get a sell signal at this level within the next few candles, that is where we should be expecting moves back to the downside. So be very careful and pay very close attention for a sell signal, especially with the other metrics lining up bearish. Now, if you trade Solana, congratulations, you just saw a massive pump. But as this plays out, you want to pay attention to the Solana metrics. And in fact, members have access to all 20 coins on our website worth of metrics. They'll have access to our trade setups. We actually just posted two more today. We're currently at 79 wins, zero losses with 11 active trades. Members get access to our future forecast videos where we show our $1 million, 400% profit crypto challenge. You don't want to miss these videos. They're going to be really important. And if you want to access all these benefits and more, you can join our membership at the links in the description down below. Go ahead and scroll down, click more. The membership is going to be the first link. Click that. It'll bring you to our membership page. Full access, $59 a month is a limited time offer. You do not want to miss out because price increases will be coming as the bull run starts. Members get access to future forecasts, all trade setups, live Zoom coaching every single month, metrics across 20 coins, $450 off our indicators with a members only coupon and many more benefits. Just go and click subscribe now, follow the prompts, and we're so excited to trade with you soon. Heading into the live charts, we're looking at Solana USD on the one day time frame, trading with the TC top and bottom finder, price versus well money flow, and trades in favor indicators. We have seen a massive pump in recent days that has far surpassed previous expectations. We were testing testing $38.79. This was my absolute top expectation for Solana, but as you can see, as today we actually broke through this like it was nothing. Currently the price sits at $45.50-ish. We see price versus well money flow high, trades in favor high with an 89% chance of a pump and if we see a sell signal, this will almost guarantee the next move down. You can see right here, price versus well money flow high, trades in favor high. We got a sell signal that subsequently moved down as well. I'm going to take you to the four hour time frame. Price versus well money flow is high, trades in favor is high. We see an 88% chance of a drop. Personally, I'm not going to pay attention to the sell signals on this time frame. They are reliable. Sell signal move down, strong sell move down, strong sell move down, sell signal move down, but the price is pumping too rapidly for this time frame. I think one day is definitely going to be the one to watch. And if we look at the one week time frame, same deal, price versus well money flow high, trades in favor high with an 89% chance of a drop. If we get a sell signal on the one week time frame, that is especially going to signal a move down. Now, in order to make sure we catch these moves, if you head over to the clock icon right here, and then click the plus sign, what you're going to want to do is use the TC top and bottom finder, set it to a sell signal. Once per bar close, we're on the weekly time frame. We're gonna set this up on both the one week and the one day. I'm gonna name it sole one week sell, create another one, DC top and bottom finder, but this time it's gonna be strong sell. Once per bar close, name it sole one week strong sell, create. We're gonna go back to the one day time frame, do the same thing. And now because of these signals, even if we're away from our computers, even if we're away from the charts, whether it's the one day or the one week time frame, we're gonna know exactly when a sell signal posts, which should indicate the next move to the downside. All four of these will keep us protected no matter what, and this is gonna help us trade effectively in this market.
market. So now we're gonna know exactly when a sell signal is posting. Let's talk about my current price targets when I personally think that's actually gonna happen and therefore the next move back down is gonna happen. Heading back to the one week time frame, we can see multiple structure resistances. Solana actually respected this before pumping up. And on the one day, let's move back to that actually, sorry about that. You'll see we stopped and broke through that resistance immediately after. Now the next structure resistance that we've actively tested is at $47.25. You can see we just barely touched that. This may actually be the resistance that finally stops Solana, but I do wanna provide another one just in case because Solana has been pumping insanely high. And that one would sit way back here, a structure resistance from May of 2022 at $59.24. It's very possible we're gonna reject this structure resistance and move back down to our first support level at $38.79. We've officially broken out, so that would be an easy move. From the current price, that would be a drop of about 14%, but personally, I would not be shocked to see a bounce and move back up or some sideways movement trading for a little bit of time. If, however, we break the structure resistance, resistance at $47.25. This would be a move up of 32%. Either way, drastic moves are coming for Solana. You just need to be watching what whale money is doing. If whale money continues moving into this market as drastically as it has been, you can expect a break to the upside. If you see whale money drop, especially if we get a sell signal at this level, you can expect a move down to $38.79. That's how you need to keep track of this market. And if you want to be able to track these indicators, you can actually snag them right now for a $550 discount. Check it out. What you're going to want to do is check the links in the description down below. Go ahead and scroll down, click more. The indicators are going to be the second link. Click that. It'll bring you to the pro indicator page. Best possible deal is the membership discount right here. You get $150 right off the bat just for owning a membership. It's significantly cheaper to purchase with a membership than without one. Snag that membership, click pro indicator pack. Scroll down, click I want this, throw in that membership discount code, fill in your information, click pay. It's gonna offer you the TC top and bottom finder for $400 off. That'll give you that full $550 discount. Go and click add to cart, follow the prompts, and we're so excited to trade with you soon. With that, I just wanna say thanks so much for watching. Trade safe, trade confident, and I'll see you on the indicator charts.